Hi there, Carl here from Rugspa.ie. We have just finished a major clean on a massive Iranian Tabriz wool and silk rug on silk warp and weft, an extremely fine rug with roughly one million knots per square meter uh, density. That means for every square meter of this rug, there is one million hand knots in the rug, an extremely fine uh, rug that needs uh, lots of care and attention when cleaning. This rug took roughly uh, roughly seven hours to clean properly. Um, now what we do is we back dust with special equipment you can see behind me here, um, then vacuum and back dust again. We took out about two kilos of dry soil from this rug, which for a rug of this size wouldn't be too unusual, and we have literally transformed the rug uh, with the clean. It's taken, as I say, about seven hours to do. An absolutely stunning, stunning rug with about 25-30% silk content and made of cork wool, which is wool from the neck of the sheep. Um, they use that wool because it's finer and softer and has a higher lanolin content. That's quite pertinent for our purposes because during cleaning we need to be sympathetic to that lanolin. That's the wool's protective foil and we don't want to remove that from a rug such as this during cleaning. The silk content as well needs to be hand finished and the rug needs to be put into a pH state that uh, is sympathetic to the wool and silk which is roughly 6 to 6.5 so we test that um, and, and slightly acidify the rug after cleaning. Um, it, it takes a long time to do these because we need to individually test all of these colours for dye bleed, make sure that everything is stable. Thankfully it was with this rug. It wasn't a simple clean by any means, but it, it was an enjoyable clean. There was no problems with it. One or two stains in the field here that I'm, I'm, I'm sitting in, um, nothing hectic. The rug itself visually um, has come alive. It's changed colour during the clean. These, uh, these um, uh, creams were quite muted and grey because of the dirt in the rug. Um, and the floral motifs around the rug were very muted and the lineation of the colours outside of the picture plane or the picture field which is, is here were, weren't really vibrant so they weren't um, uh, bringing this rug alive. And with a rug of this quality, um, what you want to see is an undulation when you walk over the rug um, or around the rug of the different colours activating and coming into life as your eyes cast over them. So that's what we specialise in here at Rug Spa, is taking a rug like this and making it look like it should. Um, it takes a day to do a rug like this um, with testing um, and making sure that it's in absolutely optimal condition. We've then put two coats of fabric protectant onto the rug and a coat of moth proof. There's a big problem in Ireland at the moment with carpet moth eating wool and silk. So we want to make sure that this rug, which will last a lifetime. I've seen rugs like this, this finally made 150 years old and more. So that's it, Carl here from rugspa.ie. Just a quick, uh, a quick video explaining briefly about our processes and uh, what to expect if you give us a rug to clean. Thanks for watching the video.